I think it was probably about 26 years ago that I first came to the farm. I didn't meet Helen on the first day, but it was suggested that I would go and have a little chat with her on Thursday. So I went down to her living room, a little cottage, and there she was, welcomed me. So we sat in front of a fire, and I told her I'd never had a dream. I said, tonight when you go to bed, you keep a pad beside your bed, a pad and a pencil. And in case you have a dream, note it. I was then about 33. As far as I knew, I'd never had a dream. I remember my first talk with her, which was just that, that feeling of, here's somebody who can hear me. And that was, that was marvelous. Everything I have read of Helen Luke and the words we've exchanged together on the telephone are informed with a particular quality. And that particular quality is so fine, so sensitive, so warm, and so close to a very deep and true source that naturally a feeling of closeness. She has deeply lived um, what she has written about and talked about. There's no division between what she knows and who she is and how she acts. Wisdom consists in doing the next thing that you have to do. Doing it with your whole heart and finding delight in doing it. And the delight is the sense of the sacred.